Okay, on to the actual method, the three sets of two uh, method of playing arpeggios. Uh, by the way, I was taught this method by Matthew Fuller, who's a guitarist in Brooklyn, who was taught this method, I believe, by Dale Bruning, and he probably learned the method from someone else, too. I just want to give credit where credit's due. So, I'm going to show you three ways of playing an arpeggio, and we're just going to stick on this bottom set. We're just going to do A arpeggio, so on these bottom two strings. Actually, we're going to go to the third string on one, one form. But I'm going to show you through three ways to play an arpeggio. So like the minor form would be like that, like that, or like that. So we're going to enable, name these three a 2-1 arpeggio, a 1-2 arpeggio, and a 1-1-1 one, one, one arpeggio. And the way they're named is on the 2-1 arpeggio, I'm going to play two notes on this string and one note on the next string. On the 1 2 arpeggio, I'm going to play one note on this string, two notes on the next string. And on the 1 1 1 arpeggio, obviously I'm going to play one note on each string. Okay? So, what we do is we play the root and the minor third, and then we move over a string to play the fifth. Easy enough, right? You should be able to play that pretty easy. Okay? And then if you want to play a major arpeggio, you raise that third, right? If you want to play an augmented arpeggio, you raise the fifth. If you want to play a diminished arpeggio, you lower the fifth. So those are all 2-1 arpeggios. Okay, we can do the same thing with the 1-2 arpeggio. Play the root here, the minor third on the next string, and the perfect fifth on the same string. If we want to make it major, we raise that third. If we want to make it augmented, we raise the fifth. If we want to make it diminished, we lower the fifth. And then the 1-1 one, one arpeggio, root, third, fifth. You can raise the third, you can raise the fifth. This is a really nice way of playing augmented arpeggios, this version. Or we can lower the fifth, and that's really awkward. You know? That's the first step. So the first thing that you should do is you should be able to play each kind of arpeggio in all three forms. Play the minor, play the major, play the augmented, play the diminished, then go to the next four. Play the minor, play the major, play the augmented, play the diminished. Uh, minor, major, augmented, diminished. You should be fully comfortable with all those arpeggios before you move on to the next step.